Hi there, my name is Jim Jasinski. I'm with Ohio State University, the Department of Extension, the Integrated Pest Management Program. Behind me, you see a composite of 29 pumpkin and squash hybrids that were evaluated in the 2021 trial. I wanna give you a little bit of background about the trial so you're better able to evaluate the hybrids as you go through the rest of the video. Uh, each hybrid was planted in a plot that was 50 feet long. Uh, the plots were 15 foot on centers and in row, this, the plants were um, direct seeded or transplanted three and a half to four feet apart. When it came time for harvest in early September, uh, we were about 100% orange for all the varieties. We took between three and five representative fruit from each plot to get an average weight. We then counted all the remaining fruit in the plot. And then we took those numbers and scaled them from that 50 by 15 foot plot up to an acre size to get an estimate of the total number of fruit per acre, as well as the tonnage per acre. Uh, so if you use different uh, row spacings or plant spacings, then it's likely that your yield data will be a little bit different than what we collected here at the station this year. Uh, when you look at the hybrids, what you're going to see, you're going to see the name of the hybrid. You're going to see if it's a powdery mildew tolerant or powdery mildew resistant variety, abbreviated by PMT or PMR. You'll see the average weight. You'll see the estimated numbers of fruit per acre, and you'll also see the estimated tonnage per acre. Uh, after you get done viewing the video, if you have any questions, please feel free to contact me.
Thank you.